What's up guys? So welcome to another video tutorial in Java. So it's 11.36 p.m. 26 p.m. So why not make a tutorial video? So in this tutorial guys, uh, I'm going to discuss na about yung, kumbaga, yung symbols in or not and 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 nga and. So di ba yung naalala yung past tutorial ko yung ganyan, yung symbol in programming at saka ganyan. So, I think ginagawa ko natin yung not. So, hindi ko na-include. So, i-apply natin yung and at saka or sa Java. So, just a reminder, kung may alam nyo kayo sa C or in, or in other programming language, pareho lang naman siya. The symbol is the same. So, yun. So, let's do this. So, for example, we have integer x is equal to 2. Simple lang guys. Simple demonstration lang. Para mas madali tayo. Para mas madali tayo magkaintindihan. Ganyan. So. Hello guys. So hello. So. Um, Na-interrupt lang yung pag-record ko kasi dumating yung kapatid ko. So as I've said, para mas lalo tayo magkaintindihan. Simple demonstration lang. So. Kunwari. Uh, if. Gamitin natin yung muna yung. And. So let's use the and. So if. X is less than 2 or y and y is greater than x then let's just print na or na resistant dot out dot print din print lang tayo ng true for example mag print lang siya ng true if yung condition is true tama yung condition sa loob na ng unang if yung parenthesis of course so copy lang natin to then let's just print it false false so ganon so once we run this so x is equal to 2 is x less than y 2 is less than 10 true so this condition here is true and as i said alam nyo na i'll assume na alam nyo na ang and and or and y is greater than x is 10 greater than 2 it's true kasi mas malaki ang 10 sa 2 so once we run this pupunta siya sa true so ganun lang naman guys ganun lang naman so um let's um make uh, by the way um bago ako mag proceed sa next so baka kasi dito ko na lang isulat baka kasi ang iba sa inyo tunay na ganito for example if else kayo yung ganyan Ganyan. Huwag din lang pansin ito. So, baka nga iba sa inyo. For example, x is equal to 2. So, this is, this equal equal is actually, ginagamit yung equal equal ang syntax niya para i-check kung equal ba sa ang x sa specific na number nandito or sa 2 in this case. So, hindi niya pwedeng gawin ganyan. So, actually, that is syntax error. So, mali yan. Hindi yan maiintindihan ng computer kung kasi iba naman ang meaning nito ng isang equal sa equal equal so as i said equal equal is used to continue tingnan kung kapareho ba siya sa spe specific number so equal is used for assignment statements ganito so this is actually an assignment statement you're assigning a uh, uh, value to a variable so ganun lang naman ganun lang naman so yun so gamitin naman natin yung or so, wait lang. Try natin itong end muna. So, y is greater than... Gawin natin itong... Since this is true, let's make this false para maging true and false is false. So, let's make this, for example, 100. So, x is less than y. True. 2 is less than 10. 10 is greater than 100. False. So, true or false is... False. Diba? Pumunta siya sa false. Kasi, yung condition na to is, nag-false siya. Because, the and operator, true or false is, I mean, true and false is false. So, alam niyo na yan. So, alam niyo na yan. So, by the way, just a programming tip. Kung, if you're making like this, it's para sa akin, nasa sa inyo yan. Pero para sa akin, mas magandang dinalagyan yun yung parenthesis. Wala naman problema kung hindi, pero para lang sa akin para mas maging organized. So, yun. Ganun lang naman. So, I'm going to mamaya, once pag natapos natin itong and may 
paano kung may AND, OR, OR, ganun, ganun. So, the hierarchy of the logical operator, or the precedent. So, we'll discuss that later. So, let's try OR, OR operator. So, excuse me, balik tayo dito sa X. So, is X less than pi? 2 is less than 10? True. True to. Or, Y is greater than X? It's true. So, true or true is true. Of course. So, let's make this 90. So, X is less than Y. True. 2 is less than 10. Tama. Or, o kaya, Y is greater than 90. So, 10 is greater than 90. It's false. Pero, since nasa or, logical operator tayo, true or false is true. So, pupunta pa rin siya dito. So, it's still true. So, ganun lang naman guys. So, what if, kung meron tayong and, or, tapos may condition naman dyan na ngayon, x, and x is equal to 20, or blah, 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 blah. So, ganun na, yan na, dyan na papasok etong synergy ko. So, I'll search the, ano, so, I just made a, uh, eto. So, I'll explain this. So, pinag-aralan namin to sa subject namin. So, inanap ko na lang sa internet kasi pareho na naman na ano. So, eto yung yung precedence. So, high ang not and medium. Ang ibig sabihin lang naman ito guys is parang yung PEMDAS. Naalala nyo yung PEMDAS? So, I'll make this parang ganyan. So, naalala nyo guys yung PEMDAS. ba in PEMDAS, inuuna yung parenthesis, multiplication, division, addition. Parang ganito lang naman yon So, eto na o. Oh, explain na dito. So, this this letter A, B, C is, ano, kumbaga, sa example na to, these are the conditions. So, pag nakakita kayo ng condition na ganito, condition A, condition B, condition C. So, A or B, and C. Ganito lang naman siya. So, since as a, in logical pala, um, di ba in PEMDAS, inuuna yung parenthesis? Same dito. So, anything na i-parenthesis nyo na ano, uunahin talaga yan. So, parang sa, parang sa PEMDAS nga, di ba inuuna yung parenthesis? So, A or B and C is actually parang ganito ang itsura niya. Kapag hindi nyo, binan nito sa ano. So, unahin i-execute is yung condition B and C. So, B and C, kung ano man kung mag-true or false yan. Then, saka siya mag, for example, nag-true to. So, true, B and C. So, it is true, kunwari. So, magiging ng true or kung ano man ang value nitong A, sabihin natin false. So, true or false. Then, ganun. So, true or false is true. Example lang yon So, eto na, eto na. So, I'll, I'll put this in the description below. So, ganito lang naman yan guys, ka simple. So, as I've said, parang sa uh, ano lang naman. So, let's try. Try natin kaya. So, ganito. So, try natin tong una. So, isa lang i-try natin dito guys ha. So, this just means na parang sa PEMDAS nga, pag nakikita kayo ng and, inuuna niya, yung AND, di ba sa PEMDAS, inuuna yung parenthesis, division, then addition. So, pareho din dito. Paulit-ulit na ako. So, pareho din dito. Once na makita siya ng NOT, una niya yung titignan or execute or gagawing operation is yung may NOT, then sunod yung may AND, then last yung OR. So, ganun. So, let's try, let's try. So, for example, condition A, so for example, x is less than, x is less than 2 or y. So, gawin natin ganito, huwag natin ilagay na may parenthesis. Kasi, as I've said, it means like that. So, x is less than y and, for example, um, or... For example, again, kinakapi ko lang ito yung condition na ito. As I've said, the letters are the conditions. So, parang ito rin yun yan. So, this is condition A, kunwari. Then, Y is greater than X. And, tama. And, let's make, um, for example, X is greater than um, 20. Ganyan. So, let's execute this. So, 
Sa so, said, pareho, di ba pareho siya dito? Sa ganyan, pareho siya dyan. So, this is actually your condition A, this is your condition B, this is your condition C, dito, sa website na to. So, pag in-execute natin ito, kung manamano yung gusto nyo makita kung how it works. So, as I've said, uunahin niya is, i-execute is, itong nasa parenthesis. Ang, it means, ang ibig sabihin lang naman ito is ganito. So, as I've said, meron siyang and, uunahin niya yung may and yung ito. Kasi may and nga dito. Ito yung ano, nasa taas siya ng or. As I've said, parang PEMDAS. Parang PEMDAS. Yung sa PMDAS. So, B and C. So, dito is Y greater than X true and X is greater than 20. So, 2 is greater than 20 false. So, true and false is false. So, this part ito is already a false kumbaga na-compute na, na or na nagawa na yung logical operation false na to. So, this imagine na to. This part na to. Oops. Ito is false na to. So, pero may isa pa which is x parang sa PEMDAS kung naiintindihan niyo ako. So, false. So, Ilas na is condition A. So, condition A is X is greater than Y. So, 2 is greater than Y. It's actually true. So, this is true. Itong part na to. This is true. This is true. So, true or false. Is ito na ano natin kanina. True or false is true. So, pag rin na natin yan. It's true. So, ganun lang naman guys, di ba? I hope na naiintindihan nyo ako. Para sa akin, naiintindihan nyo kasi konting tingin lang naman. And I've already discussed the PEMDAS. And para sa akin, alam nyo naman talaga ang PEMDAS. Pinag-aralan nyo ng yung high school. Basta ang point dyan is, is, eto, yung basta kung anong, eto lang yung tatandaan nyo. Ito lang, kahit ito lang na part na itong tatandaan nyo. Yung basta, ito yung inuuna, yung not, high siya, then medium yung ano, then low. Basta, inuuna ang and kesa sa or when it comes to executing the logical operation. So, ganun na naman guys, ganun. And, bago kong, kong makalimutan, what if kung i-parenthesis nyo to? What if kung i-parenthesis natin to? Ganyan. So, ganyan. As I've said, as I've said, anything, pag once na ginawa nito, hindi na masusunod ito. Kasi, iniba nyo na yung, yung, kung mga yung way. Kasi, naging yung parenthesis. As I've said, kahit anong, kahit anong pagkakaayos nyo ng logical, op yung operation, once na iniba nyo yung, yung pagkaparenthesis niya, Hindi na, hindi na to susundin. Hindi na to, to, hindi na to susundin. So, try natin. So, ganito. So, since may parenthesis siya, basta tandaan nyo, kung ano man ang nasa loob ng parenthesis, inuuna niyan palagi. Inuuna niyan. So, let's try this. So, since this is, ito yung may parenthesis, di ba? Di ba yung nandito sa website? Ito yung may parenthesis, B and C. So, ang ginawa ko lang is, pinarenthesis ko yung A at saka B. So, A or B. So, Uunahin is yung A or B. So, dito, kasi hindi ginawa ko ito dito. So, it's X less than Y. It's true. So, true. This is true, actually. This is true. So, is Y greater than X? It's true. So, this is actually this whole logical operation is true. So, and saka siya mag-execute dito is x is x greater than 20 is 2 greater than 20 it's false okay so true and false is false so i'll, I'll bet that pag na natin it's false di ba as i said di ba tama so di ba kung alisin natin to di ba na naiintindihan niyo guys kung alisin natin to magiging true siya. Kasi, 
binasa ng program or ng binasa ng computer is like this. Pero, as I've said, once na iniba nyo yung nilagyan nyo ng parenthesis ng ganyan, ganyan, sana yun. So, iniba nyo yung, yung, kumbaga, yung precedence niya or yung hierarchy niya. So, once na, as I've said, once na iniba nyo, nilagyan nyo ng parenthesis, <coughs> excuse me, ng ganyan. So, basically, hindi na masusunod yung yung ganito, yung precedence niya or yung hierarchy. So, pero mang, mangyayari lang naman yun if ginawa nyo ito. So, yun lang yun yung parenthesis. So, again lang natin. Di ba kanina, inalis ko yung parenthesis. Nag-true siya. So, dito, nag-false na siya. Kasi, inuna niya na tong i-execute bago yung eto. Kasi, eto yung eto yun yung ibig sabihin nun sa kung sa totoo talaga, kung hindi mo lalagyan ng parenthesis dito. So, ganun lang naman guys. I hope na naintindihan nyo ako. So, para sa akin, naintindihan, ko, naintindihan nyo naman ako. So, alam nyo naman, naniniwala kasi ako, alam nyo naman yung PEMDAS, alam nyo naman yung logical operator. So, I'll post this in the description. So, basta tandaan nyo lang guys, tandaan, ito lang yung kailangan nyo tandaan. Hindi nyo ito kailangan tandaan yung meaning nito yan. So, ito lang yung kailangan, kailangan nyo tandaan yung precedence niya o yung hierarchy ng um, logical operators. So, yun guys. I hope na intindihan niyo ako. I na-explain ko naman ata sa best way. So, thank you guys for watching this tutorial. So, I hope na may natutunan kayo. So, experiment lang. And basta, rules are rules. Ito, ito yung rules. Ito yung rules. Ha. So, well, depende pa rin kung Lagyan, as I've said, lagyan nyo ng parenthesis, ibahin nyo yung ano, yung, basta tanda nyo kung anong nilagay nyo sa parenthesis, automatic uunahin yan. Parang PEMDAS nga, parang PEMDAS. So, yun guys, thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope na may natutunan kayo. Thank you, thank you. See you in the next one. Thanks!